Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to walk through setting up a streaming ready audio setup using VoiceMeter Banana, a powerful and free virtual audio mixer that gives you full control over your sound. Whether you stream games, record podcasts, create content on YouTube, or just want to separate your audio sources, VoiceMeter will completely change how you manage audio on your PC. We'll cover connecting your microphone, routing system and game audio, isolating apps like Spotify and Discord, sending a clean audio mix into OBS Studio. I've added chapters to this video so you can skip ahead or revisit any section anytime. Check the video timeline or description below. So let's jump in. First things first, let's download and install the software we need. Head over to the vbaudio.com, link in the description, navigate to banana and click on the download link. After downloading, run the voice meter banana installer then restart your computer this is very important to activate the drivers correctly let's launch voice meter banana yes it looks like the cockpit of a spaceship but once you understand the layout it's very logical on the left side there are hardware inputs these are physical input devices like your microphone audio interface or instrument line in you see three channels hardware input one two and three now moving on in the middle section you'll see virtual inputs these represent audio coming from software on your pc now on the right side there are outputs this is where the audio gets sent there are three sliders a1 to a3 physical output device like headphones or speaker which can be controlled here and there is also b1 and b2 these are virtual outputs used to send mixed audio into obs studio or other recording software think of voice meter as your virtual mixing board it lets you control what you hear what your stream hears and what gets recorded separately don't worry if this still feels a bit confusing in the next few chapters we are going to walk through a step-by-step -step example setup that will make everything much clearer from mic setup to isolating spotify and sending clean audio to obs once you see it in action, the layout will start making perfect sense. Before we dive into the actual setup, let's make sure window route all audio through voice meter. This means setting voice meter as the default system playback and recording device. Now, first of all, open sound settings. To do that, right click the speaker icon in your taskbar, select sound settings, or you can go to the settings system and then sound. Now, Set default output device. To do that, under output section, you have to choose voice meter input. This sends all system audio, game, YouTube, apps into voice meter for full control. Now, choosing input device. Under input, choose voice meter output B1 or B2. You can choose either. They do the same thing. Before setting up your microphone, make sure you have selected your headphones or speaker in one of the hardware output slots, that is A1, A2 or A3. To do this, go to the top right corner of voice meter, click the A1 button, choose your preferred output device like headphone, earbuds or desktop speaker. Optionally, you can use A2 or A3 if you want a secondary output device like routing audio to a speaker and a headset at the same time. This allows you to hear everything voice meter is processing especially important once we connect your mic next let's begin our actual setup by connecting your microphone into voice meter under hardware input one click the label choose your microphone from the list this could be a usb mic xlr mic via audio interface or even a headset mic talk into it you should see the input meter bounce when you speak to hear yourself enable the even button below the input this sends your mic audio to your headphones. Now let's make sure you're capturing desktop audio and system audio like games, YouTube and app sounds. Since we already set voice meter input as your Windows default playback device earlier, any sound your system produces is now routed into voice meter first virtual input strip. You can control its volume, mute it or direct it to different outputs like headphones, stream, etc. by using the a1 b1 and b2 buttons this is the foundation of routing you now have control over your desktop sound now let's take it one step further what if you want to play spotify for yourself during a stream but not let your viewers hear it first of all open spotify in the background now open sound settings 
like I showed you before, find Spotify in the app list, set its output to voice meter aux input. Be careful, do not set it to voice meter input only, set it to voice meter aux input, which is mapping to the second slider in that output section. Back in voice meter, find the aux input strip, turn A1 on so you can hear it, go to OBS, add a new audio output capture device, name it Spotify or whatever you want, then select voice meter aux input. Now you can vibe to music and your viewers won't hear a thing. This method works for any app including Chrome, Discord or a second browser for alerts. That's it for the voice meter banana full setup tutorial for streamers. If this helped you, give it a like and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching and happy streaming.